Hey everybody, welcome back to Milwaukee, Wisconsin. We're here at MACNA 2022 and I'm here with Craig Timms from hey man. Senai. How you doing? How are you, man? Yeah, good. How's good, the thank show you. so far? Yeah, it's been really interesting. We've met some really cool people. Um, lots of people wanted to know about what we do. Lots of people that kind of know what we do and have been happy. So um, I'm, I'm cool with that. So tell me about Senai. Okay, cool. So Senai is all about protecting livestock. That's what, that's what our products do. And um, we have a whole range for tropical keepers, ponds, or reef keepers. So our main parameters are ammonia, pH, temperature, and water level. A lot of people think that you don't need to measure ammonia past the cycle, so they buy their ammonia test kit to see where they're getting on, and then they don't use it again, and that's kind of fair enough. Ammonia spikes do happen. They happen quickly, and they're gonna spike, it's gonna kill stuff, and it's gonna get processed by uh, the filter bacteria that are in there and um, it's gone again. And you don't know why that damage happened to your fish or why they're getting ill. So we monitor ammonia constantly and we monitor it down to parts per billion. So we can see ammonia all the time. So you are gonna see waves, but there's nothing to worry about um, because it's in the safe range. And uh, when there's a problem, it's gonna go up and we're gonna tell you that there's a problem before there's a problem. And the interesting thing as well, I don't wanna bore you with the science of it, sure. is test kits uh, and photometers, uh, typically with reagent based, they don't measure toxic ammonia. Ammonium isn't particularly toxic to fish and it's uh, in concentration, in, uh, sorry, it's in, in the water with ammonia at the same time, but which, how much of which species you have depends on the temperature, the pressure, the salinity, and as pH goes up, ammonia gets more and more toxic and there's more and more ammonia in the water. As pH okay. comes down, there's less and less ammonia in the water. So when a test kit, an ammonia test kit, which is measuring ammonium and ammonia, TAN, T-A-N, um, is telling you it's 0.2, the actual toxic component of that is very, very small. And it might not be enough to be damaging to your fish. Uh, so our product works by plugging it in, basically into a USB port, it could be a phone charger, you pop pop one of our replaceable slides in and these are going to light up when there's a problem with your water. But this little guy is monitoring your water parameters every 30 minutes. If there's a problem with your livestock, you just plug this into your PC and then you get all of your data and then you can review it to see what happened, basically. Okay. The next level is, if you're plugging it into your PC and it's connected to the internet, this is going to upload all of that data to our senai.me dashboard. You're going to get text message and email alerts if this is still connected to the computer and dangling in your tank. The next step is, if you don't want to have it connected to your PC all the time, which nobody does, um, you use the Senai web server. And this little guy, you just plug in your Senai, it's going to power it. You connect it over Ethernet to your router, or we include a Wi-Fi module in our Senai reef pack, or the Senai web server if you buy it with the module. We do sell it without, which makes it a bit cheaper. Um, you plug that in, and then you get remote monitoring 24-7, text message, uh, email alerts when your water parameters go out of check. So inside your Senai web server is a little web address, and as long as your iPhone or Android phone or whatever phone is connected to your local network and this is on the same network, you're able to essentially log into this and get all of your data, change all of your settings from the phone, have the full control over it. The way it actually works is we have a slide-based system inside. So you take the back cover off, and inside here we have two photometers, and these little guys are measuring the uh, slide. And these two sections on the slide are our ammonia and pH sensors. And all you need to do is register your slide on our app. So there's a QR code on these, and uh, you scan that little QR code or put the long code in on our website to register your slide. Pop that in every month, and then you have constant ammonia and pH monitoring. We do a couple of little accessories like magnet holders to hold this in the right place. We do leak detectors which plug into the Sano web server. And then you've got a whole suite of monitoring stuff. But like I say, we're all about protecting livestock and that's what we do. So Sano is distributed in the US by Coralview. Well, Tim, thank you. Thank you, Craig. Um, uh, if you're looking for a product that monitors, check out Senai. Uh, Cheers. Thank you so much. Cheers, man. And we'll see you later.